Hi, this is Queen of Cups, and I'm back. I want to take the time out to say thank you, thank you, thank you for your likes, shares, and subscribes. Um, bearing with me. I know I just started the channel and took off all that time, but I'm back. Um, had a little bump in the road, match of business, because I don't be in y'all's like that. But um, I will be posting more often now. I done started this video like three times, okay? The only reason why, because this setup is hitting on my nerve, y'all. But we're going to get it together. Because I said we're going to grow with this channel. We still growing. Anywho. Um, I did tweak a little some. Um, I had some little stuff um, in my description box. I had a little update about my sign. I had um, put the wrong stuff. So I updated that. Any um, information you need will be in the description box. I will be updating that more also. So watch out for them updates. Um, Gemini's, I want to say thank you. You had the most views out of all uh, my videos. Go, Jimmy Jims. Um, so I will be doing your video after this video. I was compelled to do this uh, February the 19th reading. Uh, it's not going to resonate with everybody. Get in where you fit in, okay? Um, I had the word, um, brash came to mind. So, um... This is definitely dealing with the person um, that you was dealing with or somebody saw and perceived um, that from you. Um, this will be a timeless reading. Once again, this is February 19th. Um, this reading will be um, Where Do We Stand? Um, so, um, I wanted to let you guys um, know that little bit of information. And let's get into the reading. When I was um, meditating, I also got something was over. Somebody's thinking about ending a situation. Only because you didn't see this person's brash behavior or being as brash as you did in the beginning. So this person might have came off as charismatic, um, charming, compassionate, understanding, and then they kind of switch. But it really wasn't no switch. We see what we want to see until we actually see. Okay. Um, so, um, and some of you guys actually see, and that is not something you wanted to deal with or thought you should deal with. Um, so let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's see what we got going on here. Okay, what do you have for the collective? Where do the collective stand with this other person? Where does the collective stand with this other person? And I know you guys, I have to work like over time to get these videos out. And I will be dedicating more of my time, uh, compassion to this reading. Like, I'm telling you, once you don't do cards for a while, you just start to get like, oh, I was like, oh, I got to do my cards. I love my cards. And you know I'm a cup is of um, Pisces and Aquarius, so my mood started to switch like, oh, I want to do my cards. I got to get into my cards. Okay. Let's see. Thank you. Um, you can be dealing with the Gemini. Definitely uh, um, soulmate, twin flame situation um, that um, you would deal with. Somebody far away, somebody maybe younger. Like I said, um, this page of wands too. I'm picking up, of course, the word brash is a, a meaningful cocky. So he's very cocky to me, this page of wands. <clears throat> I'm also a Leo. Uh, like I said, this person, you know, was very outgoing, totally different, totally different before you saw the cocky. This person also likes to dress well, dress nice as well. Or well, this is you. At first, it was all give and take between you and this person. Or you didn't see that this person liked to give what they wanted to give and kept what they wanted to keep. And not share. 
also it might be a Virgo to you um um with within and um actually saw that this what this what this what this person was doing or maybe this person okay they said and also too maybe this person showed you they was one way here and another way um somewhere else and that tipped off the sign of saying okay this is not where and me and this um i want from this is not what i want from this person um you show me one way here you know that you're this type of person in this way that I, here yeah so this um this tower moment that you had it wasn't bad it was just a realization I don't, uh, depending on this, how it could be good, could be bad. Uh, and this one, I say it was a realization. You realized y'all yeah, just was not a good fit. You did a little Scorpio. Um, I have Gemini, Virgo, Scorpio, Leo here so far. You just wasn't a good fit. This, um, the foundation may have was, um, looked at, uh, stable between you guys at first. And then it, it just became something something that was there all along has always been unstable but you didn't recognize it until you had this tower moment to the point it's like yeah this is not gonna work this is not gonna work somebody also made it act like the kid like acted like a kid at first they might have not they might have came off they collected was mature and then slowly uh maybe the attitude reflected um, that they were childish like I'm getting a childish type of um, vibe as well so did you guys just see the little white thing flying across the thing always so those always say those are um, spirit come to visit me I don't know what it be but it'd be like the little white fairies or the white stuff flying and I get it across my kids camera sometime and that's how I be like okay I know spirits is in there um, watching over them I don't get it often and I keep my house pretty much dust free as much as I could because I don't like a lot of dust I have the allergies so I don't do too much of wanting to keep a lot of dust around here but um I found that very unique um anywho yeah um this foundation was not stable after the sour car you have this new pinnacles yeah it wasn't um as stable as you thought it was maybe it was money problems this person came off to, like they was you know um they had money or you started to see they was giving less to the, um you or less to the situation and more to something else um maybe this person um had um, a surprise baby, not even a surprise baby, maybe um, child support was involved or um, they had uh, a child more, another expense they had to take care of um, dealing and it maybe they was immature and dealing with that uh, expense and you was like, no, if you can't even take care of you, that far as um, expenses, we can't. Okay, could be um, a younger person, Sag Leo, Aries, Scorpio. Yeah, you definitely put an end into this. You had passion, compassion for this person. You, you know, just like I say, y'all was. This is it was it was a relationship. It was a um, partnership. It wasn't too old, and it wasn't too fresh. So this is something that wasn't like years and years you went on and didn't see this in this person but it was enough time to go on with this person showed their true colors took off their mask and you realized you did not want to deal with this anymore it's mercury retrograde also so this would be the time where you know a lot of things are coming out you start to see this is the time where you know things you know everything is getting tested Things like that. Yep. And you saw this opportunity. This was a good opportunity for you to break away from this um, type of relationship. Because this is not something that you wanted. It, the realization after um, the tower moment, you, you didn't want it. It wasn't stable enough for you. Yeah, you, you were in your head about the situation. <clears throat> and you was tired of being in your head about the situation. Of wondering how this person can actually turn out to be that person that they are that you see 
<clears throat> Some of you guys are actually holding yourself back, hoping that this is not who they really are. Like they, you're holding. Some of you guys holding on to when you first met this guy, this person. Um, or this person is still holding on to when they first met you, vice versa, getting where you fit in. Yeah, so, um, some of you guys are still thinking, some of you guys are thinking also too, like, what the hell was I thinking? Okay. Yeah, definitely ready for this cycle to be over. Definitely ready for this relationship to be over. Some of you guys um, are still thinking that do I want to give this a whirlwind? Some of you guys are like, I might can actually deal with this. Um, you know. Some of you guys are really definitely just moving on. You're leaving this behind. This is a cycle that's closed. This is a chapter that has been closed and you're moving on. And some of you guys too also, like I said, it's about your, um, some of you guys are like, I have a whole reputation to protect or people is, um, maybe was, um, expecting a lot from this relationship. If you guys, um, like I said, it looked it like you were, a, a, a good fit for each other on the outside but it was like only if people knew on the inside so um it was like you had people looking um inside out of this um outside in of this situation okay Some of you guys also too uh, was giving more to the situation and um, then what you should have been given. And you guys are just like, um, why was I compelled to give more to this situation than I should have? Yeah, so I'm definitely moving on. Could be with cancer as well. Um, definitely not putting in no more work or some of you guys are just moving on putting your working on um yourself putting back to work into yourself after this relationship okay i'm going to start doing some clarifies because when i start getting the same cards that keep saying moving on i got to start clarifying because there's nothing else because you're just basically at this point you're ready to move on you saw what you saw you didn't like it it wasn't something for you um you saw the immaturity in this person that's obviously a grown person it's supposed to be grown um you like i said you didn't like it so you moved on Some of you guys actually are trying to convince yourself to stay. Like, maybe if I just deal with this, maybe if I just deal with that. Y'all know my, my business. But, um, yeah. Some of you guys are just doing this. Thing. Like, I can't believe this person here was really this damn person the whole damn time. Okay. That's why I said that's how we're like. What the hell was I thinking? Leave us enough to retrograde and pull y'all some shit. Depending on. Yep. Then the world of Taurus world with half a coin. And that's why I say this was like a young, this was not young, this relationship was, it was fresh. Like this wasn't no 10 year type relationship, six years, nothing like that. This was like, a, um, maybe six months to a year. I don't do too much time prediction, but yeah. Yeah. Yep. Somebody saw 
somebody saw somebody's um true nature somebody was exposed um to this type of was exposed to this type of behavior like they like they um they saw the um they saw the um I'm sorry you guys they saw the um you saw, they saw, or you saw the true side of them, Ace of Swords. You saw the um, truth and clarity of the whole situation that this person, you cannot, like I said, you cannot deal with. Or maybe they were child, childish. They had it. too many lies and secrets already in the beginning. You just couldn't deal with it. Okay. Um, you saw that the baby, at first, this person was a whole. Uh, was on board with the whole give and take. Then they slowly was um, started to be a taker. They pretended in the beginning they could give. They could match match you and really couldn't. And that's in anything far as um, maturity level, financial level, emotional level, all of that. And some of you guys, I'm also saying religion was also a factor as well. <clears throat> Cards is jumping. Hold on, you guys. Hold on. Yeah. Some of you guys even. Yeah, some of you guys that you saw they started to hold back. It's like, how did you get yourself in this predicament? Or oh, you started to hold back from overextending yourself, giving. Yeah, you went within and saw this is too much of a burden. You started to realize hey, this is not the stability that you wanted. This is not what you you signed up for. This is not what you your wish fulfillment was. And it may have seemed like that in the beginning, like this person portrayed to be the one. Yeah, I'll take you. <laughs> You started picking through, sorting through things. No. You started to realize and you started to see. Okay. Yep. Also, too, um, I'll pick it up. Some, for some of you guys, this... Um, this person also made it portray like they wanted to have something stable, have a um a solid foundation with you. And um some of you guys are um got a message spiritually that um let you know this this wasn't the this person did not was not interested in the stability, being stable, grounded, nothing. Knight of Wands. Yep, and you definitely want to move on. You done lost the passion for this, passion for this. Some of you guys are still undecided. Some of you guys are undecided if you want to um still deal with this, and some of you guys are definitely moving on. Yeah, I mean, you guys, I definitely not give it to this anymore. Definitely, it was meant for this to, like, just not even last. Yep, moving on. Some of you guys are freeing yourself from the mental anguish of how this person switched on your ass like that. Did a whole 360, and you saw what you wanted to see, and now you see. And you suck like how in the hell I didn't see. Okay. Yeah, some of you guys, nope, I'd rather be fucking single. I'd rather be single. 
to deal with this bullshit. You're childish. You don't really, you're not about an equal give and take. It's not fair. You holding back. You give to what you want to give to. Um, it's all about you. Yep. And that's crazy. That's the second time I got the world on top of the world. And the last reading I got the world on top of the world. This cycle is definitely meant to close. This is definitely something that um, you thought was meant. That's not meant. This is not, um, this was not, um, oh, it, it was a, like a bump in your journey. Um, something you, um, I got a test of your intuition. A test of your intuition. So this definitely was a test. Okay, because some of you guys. Uh, got the message you spirit or saw that this person yeah that you um Aries um that you you really wasn't <clears throat> this really wasn't the wish fulfillment to you and most of you guys are moving on to your wish fulfillment which is self love um self care independence your own stability it's like I'd rather be single and have my own damn stability yeah, will of fortune, basically. Yep, stepping into your own power, um, doing your own, uh, balancing your own masculine and feminine energy. So, um, yeah, this is basically somebody that, um, like I said in the beginning, showed you that they was all about the whole lover settling down, wanting to be with you. Um, wanted to make something with you. Y'all looked it good. It was a good show to put on. And then it slowly turned into a nightmare. To the point this person was maybe childish. Like I said, they stopped giving. Uh, whether that was emotionally, financially, physically, they just stopped and, and their behavior switched. Maybe this person uh, partied a lot and they usually didn't party. Or they um, fell into some type of... Um, I'm going to just stop pretending and just be me. And um, you didn't like the real them. Or this is vice versa. Like you got comfortable to the point you was like, okay, I'm just going to show you me. Okay. Um, of course, now all of my energy done ran out. Because like, so it's just like the third time I did this reading. But um, yeah, some of you guys are definitely just over this. You're over, um, like I said, you thought that you, that it was, this person was going to be the one. You guys looked great together. It was a great match. You, um, it was, it was fine at first before this person showed you who they was. And when they did show you who you was, it, it, who they was, it was something you did not want. It was a realization of this is not what I want. This is not what my wish fulfillment is. This does not make me happy. It's more of a burden. I want to end this. Somebody might try to, um, might was in the relationship that, um, try to tee the tar and be like, okay, you know, I really did want to, you know, um, I do, I want to try the whole, um, make this this work but it was still it's still a whole lot it's more of a like um when you have that whole brash attitude it's more of a um you're doing it from your purpose so this person was like maybe um you know trying to compromise with you okay i'm gonna do you know i didn't know you felt like that maybe listen also too i meant to say i was shouting that song that beyonce song listen so somebody definitely wanted to be listened to and somebody, like I said, somebody might have um, spoke about this, sent you a message or you sent them a message and it was like, I maybe want to work on it. And then it was like, okay, I'm too excited. But then it was like, nah, you already showed me the real you. And it's like, it's not going back. It's no going back. Uh, because it's like, after that, what, what else are you supposed to do? So, some of you guys is like, no, 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 no. I see my niece people say, no, 
No. No. Just no. Okay. Let's pull some oracles. I'm not going to keep you guys long. Like I said, this is um, a timeless reading. It's not going to be too long. Some of you guys are definitely happy for being single from this. Like, this is like a little short nightmare. Like, I just, I'm very happy I'm over this part. <laughs> I'm over this part. Or somebody's over, ready to be over with your ass. Like, they is done with your ass. They done. They like, she did not display this. He did not display this when we first met. Now, they, all of a sudden, it's done with haywire. It's no reasoning with this person. It's all about them. Um... They childish and maybe like I say in communication, holding back, they don't know proper give and take, they act like they did at first. Okay, let's pull some oracles on this. Told you. My car's gonna be lying, boy. Don't lie. Don't lie. So you don't lie. I ain't finna sing for y'all. I'm not finna do it. Okay. I need some good walk cards. Okay. And look at it. All right. So I got divine passion. Be honest with yourself. What is your heart's true desire? So that's why I said you had a tower moment. You was not feeling this shit. Or they had a tower moment. They weren't feeling this shit. You switched up. They switched up. Somebody switched the hell up. And they was like, no, 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 no. What I say? No. They won't finna have this shit. It ain't. That it, that's not what they signed up for. They want what they wanted. They, it ain't. Oh, like, I just hear you get out of Dodge quick. That's what Spirit told their ass. Get out of Dodge quickly. After they had that, you had that realization. Or they had that realization. Say get out of Dodge quickly. Okay. Yeah. Definitely dealing with a commitment. God. Spirit to have friend on top of this. I told you I don't make this shit up. I can't make it up. Even if I tried. <sighs> Which I don't be trying. Tell you that. But, um. Yeah. This definitely was Spirit. So, um, what he asked is this, God saying, get the hell out of Dodge. This ain't what I sent for you. I don't know what you saw, you thought you saw, but now you see. Here we go. And see who. You see, I perked up a little bit. Because, you know, I love it when my cars don't lie. Don't lie. They be trying to mind that business, but y'all coming here. And see who. Be strong. You are stronger then you think you are and your strength assures a happy outcome exactly you had to strength you had the um strengthen yourself to realize to know this is not what you wanted you're not going to accept this or this person was like hell no i'm not going to accept this this shit i've been through i'm not going to go through this shit again not nothing that look like it smell like it walk like it talk like it I ain't got no kind of time and what i tell you no so um you definitely Definitely um, could be also a Leo too dealing with this. Um, okay. Yeah, definitely giving, um, giving to yourself. Um, starting to give um, more to yourself. Some of you guys can be... Um, <laughs> Probably going to the gym. Some of you guys, um, because some people have a different way of, um, doing a whole outlet. So some of you guys, I don't know why I just picked up on the gym. Some of you guys, this situation has to the point it just, um, made you, um, you ready to work this off. Like, <laughs> I don't know why I got that. Ready to work this off. Okay. So, um, Uh, you um also can be feeling like it it, it also make you it can be having not the young feeling but more youthful after this situation like this situation probably made you feel like oh 
you know, over time it did. And then you're feeling more, you know, you don't let the situation go. You're feeling more youthful, feeling more, you know, back into it. Okay, don't back down. Stand up for what you believe is right. So that's why I said some of you guys are like hell to the no no. I'm not gonna deal with this shit, okay? This ain't what I want. This ain't what I signed up for. This ain't what even what I prayed for. Yeah, so many situations. Like I said, this can be um whew, dealing with um you just like I said, uh not taking taking any um uh, anything less of what you want you're not taking it expect a miracle have faith that your prayers have been heard and are being answered so just because this situation did not pan out right this like i said i kept hearing a test of your intuition a test of your faith a test of all of this is a test because for you to recognize it's it's like um you've been going through this whole thing and you um you recognize that um it's not um it's not what you um want it so you 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 know after you clear this that something is better that's always how it is you know after after a storm it comes clarity you know okay let's pull one on expect a miracle yeah so you don't have to be in your head about the situation of what's what's going on some of you guys you know feel like uh, what what the lesson did i learn from this and it was to hide your intuition it was to go on your intuition like you 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 saw the ray uh, you didn't get too deep into the point of um it caused a lot of me too much mental anguish or um physical to your body um mental and things like that so um it's like this this too shall pass. You will um get over this. Okay, yep. So once you let go, you, you can have once once you let go um completely, because you know after this you still have to do a little um healing. Cause some of you guys feel like I just can't believe this shit. So once you do the healing, you can expect um, nothing but great things. Boundaries. Love yourself enough to say no to others. Demand your time and energy. Exactly. This is not something you want to give your time and energy to. After a while, you start to see this is not what I want. Once again, it, it's not what you um, signed up for. You didn't pray for this. Um, Queen of Swords. Um, she used discernment. She's um very strict about what she want she knows what she want um and she she look she got love is levels to her she she don't she'll tell you exactly what she want what she don't want okay and start delegating ask yourself ask others including me to help you instead of trying to do everything yourself yeah so um ask for spiritual help um keep asking for um god spirit um whoever you um pray to meditate with ask for that help ask for them to help you to clear this out mentally physically emotionally yeah let it clear out um and and don't feel like um it's so much um don't let it, don't let it frustrate you some of you guys i feel like a frustrating feeling from it um where yeah you feel like you're frustrated and it just was a lot and it was overwhelming and now you need a break from it but um don't think of it like that I don't think of it like that. It's more of a missed opportunity on this person or your or your side. It doesn't matter, but either way the um this was a well needed breakup because this person and you was it, it was just not it was just no. No. Okay, you guys, that has been your where do we stand reading. So obviously you guys nowhere. There you go. Um 
like I said, this will be a timeless reading. This reading is for February 19th. This will not resonate with everyone. Um, any information you need, once again, will be in the description box. And I will be loading up more videos. Until next time, bye!